This is President Trump's first MLK Day in office, and we wanted to do something special to commemorate that. So we went out in the streets this afternoon, and we asked people, whose side are you on in the Donald Trump, Dr. King Twitter war? Of course, <laughs> Dr. Martin Luther King has been gone for 50 years, but did that stop people from weighing in on this impossible feud? No, it did not in tonight's Dr. King edition of Light Witness News. <laughs> talking to people today about the big Twitter war that's going on between Donald Trump and Dr. Martin Luther King. Why do those two not get along? Well, it seems like Donald Trump isn't really into African Americans, we'll say. Mm -hmm. And obviously... Was it wrong of Martin Luther King to call President Trump a fish-eyed fool jive turkey? Um, no, not if it's true. What are people saying about it? Um, that it's true. Yeah. yeah. Clearly, there's some history between those two from their time spent together on Celebrity Apprentice. I'm sure you remember when, yes. when Brett Michaels beat Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. at selling frozen yogurt. Mm -hmm. How much of their current fight do you think stems from that? There's probably a little bit. I mean, there's always a history. Do you remember that episode? I do remember that episode, yeah. I mean, Brett Michaels could sell frozen yogurt. Yeah. It's simple as yeah, that. Yeah, absolutely. This morning, I'm sure you saw Trump came out and said, I have better dreams than Martin Luther King because in my dreams I could fly. Yes. What did you think when you first heard that? You ever fly in your dreams? <laughs> no, but if I could, it'd be sweet, though. Was it wrong of Martin Luther King to skip the president's inauguration last year? Um, I don't think that wrong was the right word, but I think that Martin Luther King has a right to not go. Let me ask you like this. Is there any excuse he could have for not going to the inauguration? Um. I say yes, because everybody has a right to, to not go to something that they don't feel like they want to um, go maybe to. Maybe he had plans that day. Yeah, he could have had something else to go to. Maybe he had a family event, maybe... Um, maybe a funeral. Yeah, maybe a funeral. So um, I think he has the right to go to where he wants to go. Um, and I'm sure if he wanted to, maybe he just watched it on TV. Look right in there and tell President Trump and Martin Luther King what they have to do. Um, I think you guys got to sell your differences and make become friends. Happy MLK Day, Martin Luther King. <laughs> this is why we have Black History Month, okay? If you like that video, click the subscribe button, but only if you're ready for commitment.